Hawk Pride, day two. That's We've it. been feeding wild packs of dogs. Here comes one now. Campground dogs. So, apologize, day one. I think we're only gonna get a couple, couple videos out of it. Kind of spent the day kind of exploring, feeling things out a little bit, and don't want to bore you to death with us just cruising around main trails that there's uh, nothing to see, no action. Um, but then two sprinkles started uh, had some gas leakage problems out of her fuel cell around the ring we may or may fuel not pump. <laughs> have it fixed but we'll see and so we we messed with that a little bit yesterday and day one on merlin destroyed my belt so i had to come back and put a stiffer spring in the secondary so yeah fighting some technical issues yeah if you've already watched the merlin video um it's a really cool trail really fun um, technical a little bit and uh, but uh, yeah you can see you can hear her motor revving up and everything spinning but tires not really going nowhere so we had to, luckily we had that heavier spring at 145 no that ain't right 185 245 secondary spring luckily it came in the day we were leaving to come down here yes. so <laughs> Thank you, Venom. <laughs> yeah, so we got that in time. We swapped it out real quick, and I could tell following around, it just performed much, much better. Oh, yeah, it felt better. A lot so, better. anybody who's been following around on the clutching and gear reduction video, the secondary spring 185, 245 from Venom Products, throw that in your secondary and be done with, with you know, it, it might not totally get rid of the belt slip because you're going to be putting yourself in some bad situations but but it's, it helps yeah it was night and day difference even just cruising around i think she was having problems you know on our last ride because i kept saying oh it's just so low it's so low i don't like it but i think my belt might have been slipping some of the time because it doesn't feel that way now it no. doesn't feel near as low so I didn't have the camera rolling when I went back to get some parts to try to fix the fuel pump. Amber was hiding in a trash can, <laughs> trying to scare me when I came back. But he knew I would be up to something, so it didn't work. So Hawk Pride off-road, and if it's within driving distance of you, it's a cool, cool place. Uh, you're really gonna like it if you got 32 inch tires and above, as these rocks are big, so. But they grip good. It's they grip good. It's saying still. so. But it is. It's fun, fun, fun. So. And hopefully. we're the only razors here so far. Nobody came with us. Yeah, there's like 400 jeeps here, and us. We're the outcasts. Usually are. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess maybe we're gonna go try find Fatty's crack in this video, maybe. Yeah, make yeah. this the Fatty's Crack video. We got a hold of Ricky Berry. He Thank. sent us a secret map. Thanks, Ricky, for uh, showing us where to go. It makes me feel like a pirate. So we got the secret treasure map. Got a secret treasure the map. Secret treasure map to Fatty's Crack. We're hunting booty. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we're gonna go find it. Hit that. Hit some other trails today. As long as sprinkles isn't marking our territory with gas all day long and yeah, we, we're gonna we're gonna hit it hard today i think so thanks for watching enjoy the videos and subscribe comment share like all that good stuff and it's cold here it's it's cold so we'll see you on the trail baby we forgot one thing is we didn't i didn't, didn't mean to make it sound like hawk pride is nowhere for beginners because it is it, they have they do a spectacular job of trail maintenance oh yeah the 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 main the green and blue trails are really nice smooth 
Uh, so if you're a beginner in the area, come on down and check it out. And you get to see views like that. Yeah, gorgeous views around here. They got some swing sets and nice bathhouses. Two swings, pavilion. Little cabins. Porta potties kind of here and there, wherever. Show them the mansion. Nice shower houses. They got three or four cabins over there that way. And then the uh, log mansion. Log mansion. About fell down. <laughs> so <clears throat> finally, are you sleepy? I'm so cold. It's my <laughs> body is doing everything to. Shoo, I didn't pack accordingly. <laughs> finally, finally found Fatty's crack. It's got three good tough spots in it right here. So we gonna make it. I hate when you talk positive smack. I'm not talking. I just I'm being <laughs> optimistic that we're hopefully gonna make it and not tear something up because these rocks are big. Like you know, like in the hill climbing videos, they say you know hill it, video don't do the hill justice. It's the same thing with the size of these rocks. So we finally found it thanks to Ricky for helping us out. It's uh, unmarked trails all the way back here. So, but it's cool. It's gorgeous. Got a bunch of rock overhangs. It is neat. So we're gonna give it a shot.
steer left and then just start to get your front end up. Pretty easy out of here. Right around the corner and crawl up out of here. <coughs> now for the four seater. Definitely a fun trail. I some big rocks. Good way to start out the day. Here we go.
you find? Pine cones. And baby pine cones. So oh, that's turkey. That's Fatty's crack. That's fun. Yes. That's fun. I am impressed with our gear reduction and the 35 inch Rockzillas. Yes. Still. So, but yeah, that was that was a fun trip. Up them ledges and stuff, beating and banging. So. And I think we're discovering I need to go back to my stock helix, which is yeah. fine. We'll do that when we get home. And why is that? Because you're we got the we got the heavy spring in there. I'm still getting a lot of belt smell. So, like you said, the helix I've got takes a lot more power to get it to spin. So it could be causing some issues, and you're not having issues with the stock one. So trial and error. Trial and error. Continue to dial, dial everything in to make a better vehicle and uh show you guys you know probably some if you, you, you want to do it you know there's i think there's a huge advantage to this setup especially if you like doing this kind of stuff but you can still climb hills and do what you want so as always thank you all for watching subscribe pretty please like and comment tell us if we're doing something good something bad whatever we'll take criticism and, and learn from it so yeah. Thank you all for watching. More to come.